Hello everybody! Welcome back to a brand new video. My name is Bokusatsu and I here I'm here to I'm here today to review well the essay figures common writer Nago beats Well Nago Kamen Rider Nago beat form from Geats from Kamen Rider Geats. This is the latest figure that just came out on premium Bandai US and uh I finally have mine. I bought the US release by the way. And uh, I have a lot of things to say about it. good and some bad, but overall, more positive than negative. But yeah, let's begin. First off, this is how far this is how far her arms go up. You want to be very careful and not try to break this piece, guy, because well, I don't know why, but uh, shoulder pieces like these are so easy to pop off, and uh, I know I'm not the only one who uh, who deal with this. Have, have not happened to me yet. Thank God. Well, good thing it happened, but uh, this just be careful with, with how you pose these because these these are so easy to pop off. And, well, you don't want to do that. Anyway, this, yeah, this is how, this is how far she goes for up here. This is her. Uh, well, this is how far she. This is how far her her ab or her uh, chest articulation is due to uh, being a small body, unlike only the guys. Because well, because, well, she is a female body, and uh, I can totally see them using this female body for Sarah and uh, maybe Lopo. But if they mix the guys and the female body for Lopo, I can totally see that happening for her. But that's just my opinion. All right, this is how far her legs go. Wanna be careful, we don't wanna break it. Well, her. <laughs> Overall, she's pretty good. You can, I can pose it pretty well. I can pose it pretty well. If they ever do give us Nago's uh, new form, her final form, I would have, I would have been down for it. But yeah, but yeah, this is how she pose. <laughs> I'm sorry, that I, I'm the. I feel I feel a little weird doing this video because I was supposed to do it tomorrow, but uh, I decided to well do it today because certain item came in yesterday and uh, well, yeah. Oh, okay, so here's here's a sneak peek of the item. It's right there. You gotta wait till tomorrow for a review on this bad boy. But anyway, but anyway, yeah, yeah. Uh, this yeah, she posed pretty well. I will say, she does not stand correctly. What I mean by that is this: there are moments that I, there are moments when I stand her, stand her next to others, other uh, geats, uh, geats com figures. Was a comment, but no, the geats figures, and uh, she does not stand well because her legs are very annoying, or her feet are, but uh, yeah. Also, I want to say that I'm I'm gonna get actually an upgrade. I made like a sticker chart for this, and same for the other buckles. For me, I don't need it since well, I don't like stickers, and uh, I'm I'll be fine without it. But yeah, now on to her accessories. Yes, she has accessories. Yeah, not give up. And yes, she has accessories like. Actually, here's her iconic guitar. I love her paint. I love how uh, painted this thing is. Perfectly painted, perfectly good scope, painted pretty well, and all that.
here we have her open palm hands. She's doing the jazz hands. <laughs> nah, it's kidding. Here we have her. I don't, know, I, don't, I don't know what the type. I don't know what the, what you call these type of hands, to be honest. But uh, yeah. Oh, 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 let me show what I'm talking about. These bad boys. I don't know what to call these type of hands. But yeah, she has them. Here are her grab hands for her guitar. And here are her regular default relax hands. If you don't want to know what she looks like with her guitar, well, let me show you. Do, 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 do. You want to be gentle with this figure and how and how you put her hands in. And here she is. The more I play the figure, the more I'm liking her. Yeah, she, she, she become a, she, she, she'll probably become a contender for this year for top 10 like Tycoon did. But now that uh, we got her, now we got her like this, onto size comparisons. So, here she is with uh, Geets. Oh, hold on. Let me uh, fix his feet. Here's his Geats with Buffer. Here's Tycoon right here. They look, they all look so good next to each other, and I'm so happy I have them. Will I get a uh, Jean in a uh, Glazar or Glare? To be honest with you, I do not know, since like, I'm not like in a rush to buy all the fig geek figures. But that's just me. And since she is a girl common writer as well, here she is with the last two previous female writer figure arts. Aguilera and Sabella. Now, if I remember correctly, Nago suit actress is the exact same suit actress as Sabella, which is why they're almost at the exact same height. If you look at them comparatively, which 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 makes sense, but at the same time, I like I, I like that small detail you can say for the figure art, but that's just me. But yeah, she stands pretty well with she stands pretty well with both of them, even though she's the best one out of the three. Well, I get out the second, and well, sorry, Rayka, you got the short end of the stick, girl. Here she is with the Black Series. Here she is with the Black Series uh, Mandalorian Ahsoka Tano. The, don't worry, my next review, my next like figure review is gonna be on her. Because, oh boy, I've been I begin to I begin to my Star Wars phase lately, so be prepared for that. And here she is. With the SA figure, Luke Skywalker from The Mandalorian. She said pretty well with both of them. Well, <laughs> well to be fair, one's an import figure. Well, two are import figure. One's a domestic figure. But still, she said pretty well with both of them.
So overall, what, what are my thoughts on the figure? Uh, okay. If you like Nago and her character so much and Geese, I'll say this, I'll say go get this figure. But at the same time, the figure is Premium Bandai. You know, well, unfortunately, Nago does not have the gimmick form chain like like uh, Geese, Buffa, Tycoon do. So that's like the biggest, I'll say the biggest downfall with this figure. But minus that, everything else about her is pretty good. If you... <laughs> If you can't make her like, if you can't make her like, uh, hold her, uh, if you can't make her hold her, uh, hand, I really do recommend trying to uh, play around with the grabbing hand a little bit to, to make them a little bit tighter so she can hold her, her guitar slash axe weapon. Because this thing is good, yes. But at the same time, there are there, there are issues that uh, well, there are issues that need to be taken care of, in my opinion. But yeah, again, really good figure. She's premium Bandai, so if you if you can find her on any real retail retailer website. Go for her, cause you need her for your geeks for your geek collection. See, that not had the see not had the gimmick form change like geek buff or tycoon. But at the same time, I'm gonna guess that uh, they're probably going to make a Nago version of her in her entry form eventually in the future, because keep in mind they Tamashi just announced a, a headset with all the male riders. That is, well, Sparrow. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, who else? Many other relevant characters from Geats. And it just, and it just reissued the entry body for a, for a premium Bandai release as well. So I'm gonna guess that Tamashi's probably gonna be doing, using this body for Sarah and maybe Lopo as well. If that's the case, then well, I'm down to go buy those two. Cause well, I, cause well, I like Sarah. I said in my Tycoon video that I'm a Sarah fan, moving on from that. <laughs> and, uh, I like Lopo a lot, actually. She, she's one of my favorite characters in the show, and I'm, I'm disappointed that she didn't come back. Yes, I know she's in the movie. I didn't watch the movie yet. I'm waiting for, I'm waiting for that to be, well, sub and be, well, you know what. But anyway. But anyway, yeah. Overall, good figure. If you want, if you want, if you want to go buy her, I think she's, I think she's on Toko Lockable for 90 bucks, which is not a bad deal. So yeah. But if you, if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, subscribe, follow all my social medias in the description. And, uh, yeah, guys, subscribe to this channel because I'm trying to hit 1000 subscribers this year. And we guys help. Well, we can get on to that goal. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, guys. Thanks for watching. Come back tomorrow when I review the uh, Hurricane Gyro. This bad boy right here. <laughs> yeah, come back tomorrow when I review the when I review the Hurricane Gyro because well, I got a lot of things to say about this about that item. And uh, yeah, guys. Thanks for watching. Talk to you guys later in the next video, which is well tomorrow. But uh, yeah. Enjoy the pictures, everyone. My name is Aaron, and I'm out. Peace.